guys happy sunday um y'all see about how tired it was about or whatever but um right now i'm trying to find me buy my point papers um and copies of that y'all i told y'all my blessings is coming i'm not questioning god i'm not rushing god and let him do his will his time so if i'm about to do y'all need some more papers i'm trying to find my wallet Everything else, but how everybody Sunday going? And she said a bill, my birth certificate. I got like five birth certificates, you guys. And you know, before I get into the before we get into the video, I'm gonna come back and tell y'all about my hair. I feel like I can't see me because the light in here is dark. Okay. Yes, I got on the same shirt. Don't mind it. Mind your business. I'm just y'all probably not mind your business. Let me explain. Well, oh, y'all. My hair, oh my God, it is so soft. Thank y'all. It's soft, soft. I had to take my uh, do-rag off my hair. Like, what? My hair is soft. So what I'm going to do, I'll come back. I'm going to take it down and brush it again. Put it back in two pigtails and put my do-rag back on my head. Yeah, but that plant making her soft. So y'all need to go do that. Yeah. New or something like that. I see you guys one time. Find this time on water. I don't know what I did with it. Y'all, it is hot. I get Lord Jesus. I will show y'all me. But right now, I ain't looking for I ain't looking that best. I want to look. So, because my hair, I took my hair down that y'all know of already. So I'm just walking to the office. It's really go. Um, make copies of these papers that I need for my information to bring Tuesday. Pray to God, I bring, I mean, I, they get it Tuesday. Like I'm claiming it, I know you gonna handle it, Jesus. So yeah, there you guys. I was thinking I wanna make it to the uh, front office. You guys, I made it to the front office. I'm walking up there now. I almost said my, I don't wanna say my name on my apartment. So I gotta turn this way so I get to the, cause I'm a flow mat. Let's see if it's open. Oh no, they gotta come open it. You gotta wear a mask. So yeah. Oh yeah, I'm tired. Oh, Jesus. Here you guys. I'm with my friend lady. My friend lady. Hi. Hi. Oh, it's hot. I just have these three in my uh, birth certificate, in my in my ID. Mm -hmm. I mean, I just got these three to uh, make copies of. Okay. You said you want me to use them? I mean, no. What you need? To uh, make copies of them. Oh, you want me to use them? No, ma'am. Okay. No, ma'am. Just one copy? Uh, yes, ma'am. Um, but is it? No, just the front part. This is for it. Is there any way that it's going to be the date on there that I did it today? Because they say it got to be 60 days, um, no, my, my wall letter. No, they're going to look at this. It has to be 60 days. Oh, okay. That, then it's, it's not. You need an updated one. That's the one. If you got 2019, that's No, one. but that's the day you got it. That's what oh, they're talking man. about. They may not take it. You can try. Thank you. Okay, you guys, I'm going back home. I told y'all I'm hot. I'm tired. Y'all don't know, it's like, oh, let me turn y'all around so I can see my face. It's about to rain out here to put on. But um, like I was saying, y'all look a mess, y'all. So I told you my hair. But uh, y'all know I don't care. Because when I do look cute, I look cute, cute. But anyway, like I was saying, you guys, um, what I about to say? I forgot. Yeah, my, my, uh, how you doing? I got a brain for it. Yeah. Oh, that's what I was saying. Like when my friend with my friend in town, I don't like doing nothing. I just like to lay down, be comfortable, stay warm, and like let the cramps go down because y'all know I cramp like a week before my uh friend about to come in town and I cramp a week when she about to leave. Y'all, who Jesus, like man, y'all don't understand what I go through. I'm messing up y'all see y'all like Brittany. Really, Brittany? Y'all, when I make grocery shirts, I just throw them canned goods and everything in that pantry and don't worry about it. It's not a walk-in pantry, it's like a cabinet pantry, but I'm praying on my new apartment. I'm gonna get, I claim it in Jesus' name, 
that I'm gonna be living somewhere new, starting fresh in my life. Now I ain't looking back at the past no more. I feel like this is one step of my goal or whatever. But yeah, cause somebody told me yesterday on, on Instagram that I'm glowing. And I don't know how I'm glowing because I feel like that I'm not halfway where I want to be at in my life or back in peace. But I thank God for um, making progress at uh, the, the house. I'm almost there. Okay, guys, right now, with what I got going on, we got the red beans and sausage bowling. We got the potatoes and oxtail bowling. I don't know if I want to do a cornbread or not. You guys, let me know down below in the comments. Should I do a cornbread? I got the brown gravy over there. Over there, I'm doing rice too, but it's like a soul food Sunday. So, yeah, so y'all let me know down in the comments. So, what should I do? A cornbread or not? So, yeah. Before we get started, I look at my pantry. Just look, y'all. I have to clean all this stuff up. What I don't like about this pantry, y'all, I don't like the cabinet material. Y'all can see, like, right there, it peels. I don't like that. Like, they need a guy before I start the pantry. Before I get started, this all ingredients that you need. If you're doing a big family or a big meal, you could do more than one box of cornbread mix. If you do, like, two people or, like, three or four, yeah. But I'm using two cornbread mix, the Jeffrey corn muffin mix. I have my two eggs, but you only need one egg for each box. I got my uh, my cinnamon, my sugar, my butter, my bowl, and my pan. I'm gonna be making the uh, cornbread with. So I'll see you guys in a minute. Let me make this. I got my phone call. It was nothing scary, but y'all just say a prayer for my 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 mother, my ex mother law and my ex word for you guys. Y'all didn't know all their business, but just say a prayer for them. I know boy got them, so okay. That's all we Okay, yeah, I want to come talk to y'all. Uh, let's go. Let's talk. Come on, I made it through. He just paused it. Paused it like, wow. I hear you, I hear you talking, though. I hear you. I hear you. But uh, like I was saying, I'm about to talk to y'all while I do the pantry, y'all. Or whatever. So I'm taking everything out so I can organize it really how I want to. So I'm going to be looking like, what the world on him? But y'all. Like I said, I'm gonna insert um you know, I got a home, a new one with the just bought another one. This song was it. I'm telling y'all I need to organize somewhere here. I don't really want to eat that thing. I ain't gonna take all this hot stuff out here, I'm gonna say the most of the candy is out of my stuff put them high high in this meat. But like I was saying though, um my my friend went to school with he had shared this um quote, it, it, this um quote, a, a, a image that makes sense, you know. He shared it or whatever. And, um, it was talking about quarantine is in the Bible, of course. I've been thinking about this for the longest. Everything that's happening in the real world is in the Bible, you know. They talk about it, they study it, we learn about it, but we don't take compassion. How you start? How, what's the, what the word for it? Um, com, passion about it. However, the word is, y'all know what I'm trying to say. We don't take that serious. So it's like when it's happening in real life, everybody is like stuck at one place, don't know what to do, don't know where to go, don't know where to turn to. I only go and asking us to do the turn to Him, lean on Him, count on Him, trust in Him. But we're too afraid to do that because of our sin. Because of our um mistakes and stuff like that, it's okay. That's why God made puzzles with the rest on so we can so we can erase our mistakes and start over with something new in our life. You know, a new beginning. You can't keep on trying to do the same thing you were doing when you was like 15 and 
18 years old thinking God is going to continue to bless you, going to continue to open your door for you, going to continue to do things for you. No, he's going to put things on hold until you get right with him and show him, okay, God, I see what you're doing. I'm listening to you, God. You know, I want you, I want you want me to follow these directions. You give me this test to follow, to, to you know, stuff like that. But we too afraid to do that. You know, I'm not saying everybody like that, you know, just people, people around the world, basically, you know. But uh, I talked to my mom about it, and then she was, ha, ha. I like her answer. My mom, my mom know the Bible. I don't say that she do it from front to back. My mom, my grandma, they know the Bible. My brother know the Bible. Oh, no, I'll get the answer from them, plus my new pass and stuff like that, you guys. But I, my, my, my mom had told me the reason why God has uh, put everybody in that ark because Noah was coming back. That's why it was flooded so many days. They they was like underwater. They couldn't, they couldn't leave the ark. Guys, there's so much that she was telling me and stuff like that, you know. I know most of points, and I ain't going to say a lot about it, but I'm going to insert that clip like right now. Um, y'all know y'all read it, y'all can see what I'm talking about and y'all understand it. But I had downloaded um the study Bible on my phone, so I'm gonna look at today. I'm gonna I'm gonna tell my, my youth pastor so he give me some verses to look up and stuff like that to study and stuff like that because you can read the Bible all day long, but if you if you don't study the Bible and take down notes, how will you know what's going on in the world? How will you know what, 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 what God did or what God was trying to do? And so if you don't take notes, so yeah, so I'm trying to do that, y'all. So y'all bear me with that. I'm just the perfect person in the world because I'm not. But let me get back to the video. Okay, come to share that with y'all. But don't be afraid to try and change your life around and, and help others and encourage the next person to do better too in life. Don't be ashamed. Forget the negativity. Forget the people that, that still want to stay behind and think everything gonna be okay in the life they're still trying to live in. Look, move forward, look forward, try to make a better time for the next generation, for the next people, so God could let us live longer to see the next, the next world come in and, and be beautiful and everything, you know, and everything go back how it used to be in life. You know, we don't want to live in this hateful, sin world, and, and God come back and just erase everything, and you know, we got to die one day, but I had another to be today. So yeah, you guys, I had to say that. So let me take it to the video, y'all, so I'll see y'all once I get through. Okay, guys, I am done. I think I did pretty good. I do most of most of the old things uh, that often not dated. Uh, this year, I threw it away. So y'all look how it looks now. My bad, I had to the cornbread. I took the cornbread out the time. Of. But yeah, but it's your girl new pantry. Yeah, I like it. You know, how I did the candy. Here come an angel, y'all. Oh my God, here she come. Yeah, we gotta run because she's bad. She's gonna turn around my house. I'm my house clean. When she come, y'all, it's a wrap. Okay, you guys, I'm back. Y'all see I'm about to shower. I'm laying just for the sleep. I'm gonna sleep till about 7 30, then wake up back up. But anyway, you guys, I'm laying down because I started I started cramping. So I moved around too much in the kitchen. Y'all can see from earlier. But, um, y'all, so turn on the dog on TV thinking we're gonna watch the, um, some sort of like a red carpet, you know. Yeah, they showing an old video from years ago, BT Awards. Like, man, all this shit bored. Hopefully the awards don't be different this year, y'all. Hopefully. But, um, yeah, screws the background noise. But I would say, y'all, uh, my stomach hurt. Like, I'm cramping. I could feel it all, like, blow my private part. You know? And stuff like that. That's why I don't like making long videos, because... I gotta sit here and edit all this stuff, you know? So yeah. But I'ma see you guys once on the BT Wars come on. I'ma show y'all that done. It's almost done, dog, I make the rice and then it's done, cause the cornbread done. The beans almost done, I think, and the meat, I think it's almost done, so yeah. I need to get my nails done on. How much I get my hair done on Thursday? So I'm ready. So yeah. Okay, I'll see you guys later. Yeah, I see I got up right out the bed, y'all got hungry. But the um, it's almost done. I'm gonna um make me a sandwich real fast. So yeah, y'all doing TikTok videos? If y'all don't follow me on TikTok, follow me on TikTok. Um, it'll be in my description down below. So yeah.
That's what I make the ham. So, have I ever ate those sandwiches? I don't know, I would throw a top bread away, I don't know what to do. But hey, I ate those sandwiches from school and y'all be like an ISS or y'all be like in the detention. Man, the meat be so freaking cold. It's like, bro, really? Like, y'all know actually warm this up a little bit. Man, like, I used to stay eating those sandwiches at school. Like, I stayed in ISS. Man, so y'all didn't say I wanted to make y'all laugh. One day, me, my sister, my cousin, we, we all got in trouble. So we all had like, I had like 15 days and I had this. So they go by days. They don't go by like, oh, you stay for one, you stay for after school and that's it. No, every time you go to school. But yeah, y'all, so like I was saying, you just, but like I was saying, y'all, so me, my sister, and my, my, my cousin got in, got in trouble because I told them somebody was trying to, this girl was picking on me. I used to always get picked on in school because about the way I walk in my womb and stuff. If nobody never knew, and people that do do know, I used to always have a jacket on in school, y'all. Yeah, I used to always have a jacket on, like nobody never saw my arm. But people that really, really know me, you know, I wasn't afraid to show. But anyway, so I told my sister, the girl was picking on me, y'all. I ain't gonna lie, she was big. So they went and approached the girl, and my sister, I couldn't just start hitting the girl, fighting the girl. Y'all know me, my mouth. And so my, when I was in high school, I had a, a petty fail mouth. Man, I cussed the principal out, I cussed, I cussed the AP out. I remember all that crap. I said, man, if this shit on down or whatever. So, so they're like, y'all be quiet. Y'all get so many days I had I said, man, I had this. So y'all like, okay, hey, Mr. Best, you got 15 days. Hurricane, my sister princess, only freaking 10 days, y'all. I was so mad. So they lied to the, um, they lied to the ISS um, teachers say that they was pregnant. I mean, no, they were vegetarian. They can't eat meat. So they got to eat um, regular lunch food. But when you're in ISS, you're going to eat a cold ha ham sandwich and give you an option, juice or water, I mean milk, and an apple, a cold apple, like you're at the freezer. Y'all, man, I, so I was, trying to play, I was trying to play along with them. They're going to tell me, oh, no, I agree y'all can't be vegetarian. I said, oh, we can't. We all cousins. Y'all, they weren't falling for me. Oh, but Princess and Erga got, got away with it. Yeah, that was so crazy. I was like, what the world? I was so more than that ISS. So I had told my homeboy, um, Chris. I said, Chris, man, get in trouble. I was texting him. I said, Chris, get in trouble. So you gonna say ISS to me? He said, nah, Brittany. Uh-uh. Tell him, I said, you get in trouble. So anything I do, he would do it for y'all. He ain't got in trouble with me. I mean, he ain't got in trouble. So he going to so give me ISS for me or whatever. So y'all, when he came, y'all, it was a wrap. Then my other girl came. Rest in peace to my homegirl. I miss so much. Roger, Rogenique, y'all. She came, y'all. All three of us together is like three stooges don't mix. Y'all, we had cut up at school. We was cutting up, like cutting up. I mean, in class. So, yeah, that, that was so funny. Like, really funny. Like, in a classroom or whatever. I wish that fun, though. I miss my homegirl, though. But, y'all, let me uh, finish making my sandwich and stuff. I gotta watch the awards. And I'll see y'all later. Let me show y'all. Let me show y'all the food before I go. The beans are almost done. The uh, meat is done. The cornbread. I'll make the rice in a minute. But yeah. So I don't want to be so dark. But yeah. So um, make sure that y'all like. Come on, look what I'm doing. Talking to y'all, making my bread. So oh my god. Yeah, my bread got hard. See, messing with y'all. I'm eat this bread. I'm eating messed up. Uh -huh. I'm gonna put mustard on my bread. Do y'all like mustard on y'all sandwich? I know I do. But um, like I was saying, um, I look tired. That lady, yeah. Now she wanna take a nap. But like I was saying, make sure y'all like, comment, and subscribe. If you're new to my channel, make sure you turn your notification post on. Hit that bell. Say it's on your girl below the video. You can be notified that. I'm gonna start calling y'all B Squad. Okay. Started on July the first, Wednesday, you guys. That's y'all new name for me. It's B Squad. Cause I don't want to keep seeing you guys. So I'm gonna put no cheese on it, cause it makes my stomach hurt. So like I was saying, let me let me finish making my sandwich. Let me um let me go.